Brit Mums. Today on Brit Mums we're talking about whether or not your child should dress according to gender stereotypes. I grew up as a bit of a tomboy, I sometimes had girls clothes, sometimes had boys clothes and I, I, think, I, I think I turned out okay. I have a, a five year old who wants to be a boy. A good proportion of my eldest daughter's pyjamas, for example, are technically boys pyjamas. For the longest time if you said to her what do you want to be when you grow up she would say a boy. I quite like things like space prints and dinosaurs and that kind of thing but for some reason girls can't wear those. My little boy who is two and a half, uh, you know he loves dressing up. I do find it slightly disturbing when he wears the little silver high heels or the ones with the little bows on them but actually I find it disturbing when my daughter wears those as well. If a child wants to explore their creativity and express independence and develop self-confidence, all that stuff, um, that's good for them. The way they do it might not be exactly what I've had in mind, but you might have just have to grin and bear it. I've often whined and whinged that she's not girly, she won't let me do her hair, she won't wear pretty dresses. If I say to you, Mia, do you want to look girly today? What would you say? No. Secretly, I'm kind of chuffed because she's independent. She knows her own mind and she'll decide what kind of woman she wants to be when she grows up. If she wants to dress as um, a ballerina or a cowboy or a spaceman, then I've got no problems with that. I think it's really important that, that children are um, are encouraged to express their individuality. One of the things with gender stereotypes, which I think is a positive thing, is it gives us a framework. Um, so people have an expectation of what they're going to see when you walk in the room. If you have a little boy who comes to school wearing a dress, they're not likely to be thinking about what his aptitudes are, what his talents are, what he likes doing. They're going to be thinking about the dress. It's not about clothes at all. Um, clothes, be well beyond clothes, it's about acceptance, I suppose. Um, and learning from my children when they challenge me to look at my own prejudices. Part of the thing about, I guess, dressing for your gender is is that it's, it does make other people around us more comfortable. So that's sort of where I am on this issue. And yes, my little boy is going to continue wearing pink dresses. Hopefully, you know, I, I am really hoping he doesn't wear them when he's a teenager, but you know, as far as I'm concerned, when he's two and a half years old, it doesn't really matter. Brit Mums.